Good morning guys and welcome back to my channel. So I'm just going to do a vlog for you over the weekend. Today is now Friday. It's my day off. So I get a Friday off every fortnight with my job because I work eight to five or I think our other option was work eight to four every day, but then you don't get that day off. But I need my day off because it's the only day that I have pretty much for all my appointments to get shit done. So that like day off a fortnight, it saves me. So I've got quite a busy day today. It's Yosip's birthday today. So he's currently at work. I need to still wrap his presents, write his card. And I've got a nail appointment. My nails are like so stuffed. I'm so rough with them. So yeah, I'm getting that done at 10.30. So it's currently 9.30. So I'll probably leave here at 10 because it takes 30 minutes to get there. I'm just eating breakfast, which I'll show you. So I've just had my porridge with well, my oats, with my strawberries and my blueberries. And then I've just made a iced coffee, which this is so good. I'll show you guys a what I eat in a day video on a day where it's not like Yossip's birthday or when like just like a sort of like a normal day so maybe on my next Friday off I'll do a what I eat in a day so you guys can see that but yeah I've literally just found out that I lost all my editing to my favorites video which I don't know if that's going to be up before or after this so yeah I've got to re-edit that again which cool that's great because I've got so much time but yeah so I'm just gonna finish my breakfast wash this off i've sorry wow i've literally started the vlog with the face mask on but i've been having like a problem areas near my cheeks i got needling done at breathe beauty and it helped so much my skin was finally like clearing up and then i got my period so i got a few more pimples again so i'm just like oh when will this stop so i've just put this detoxifying is that called Ayla? Ayla um, clay mask. Everyone knows that one, the pink clay mask. So it's for like detoxifying and brightening. So I've just put that on for the day because I do need to get photos this weekend. So, I mean, it's not bad when I have makeup on because they're all like little pimples and little red spots. But I don't know. I just want to like keep feeding my skin good stuff so that it can heal. So yeah, hopefully this helps a little bit and then I'll put my serums, my sunscreen and all that sort of stuff on before I leave. I don't know if I'll do makeup. I might put a little bit, cause I've got to go after my nail appointment. I've got to go to the shops. I have to go to JB Hi-Fi, pick up a few things. Then I need to go to the post office and get a few parcels. Well, I think it's just one parcel, but yeah, I can show you guys what was in that parcel. And yeah, so this weekend is pretty, hectic so tonight we've got dinner with Yossip's family for his birthday we've just gone to a restaurant and then I've got to leave after the dinner because my mum is holding a surprise engagement party for my brother and his partner Kelly they don't know about it obviously this video will be up after that's happened so I can talk about it but yeah how exciting so I don't want to miss out on that so I think Yossip's going to stay with his family and then I'm going to go to that. Yeah. And then tomorrow night, we're going out to the city for Yossip's birthday drinks just with some friends. So I'm going with a few friends and he's going to go with his boys and then I'll just like meet him there. So we've got that in the city. So that's tomorrow night. And then Sunday, I've booked Coco's for us just for like a dinner, like an early dinner. I think the booking's for like five I'll have to check, but I wanted to do it early so that we could watch the sunset because it's on on the river. Is it a river or an ocean? I don't know. Wow, I'm going to sound so stupid. I have no idea, but it's a really nice like view. So I thought that would be different and cool. I haven't been there for years. I don't even know if the food's good. So I'll definitely let you guys know if it is. But yeah, that's a little update of what I'm doing this weekend. I'll keep you guys with me. I'll bring you along as much as I can. And yeah, I'll check back in with you soon. So I just thought I'd quickly show you my nails. I just got them done. She did such a good job. I've just gone with black so they can, so that it can go with everything. But yeah, I thought I'd quickly show you. Okay guys, I haven't updated you in a while. Yossip's waiting in the car. We're running so late. 
we're off to his mum's now and then I'm off to the engagement. So I just wanted to quickly show you what I'm wearing before I head out the door. But this is what I'm wearing. It's actually a jumpsuit and this was actually one of the first things I ever got sent like five years ago. Um, and I'm finally wearing it. But yeah, and then I've just put like a little white blazer on top. But yeah, I've got to go and I'll check back in later tonight, maybe at the engagement. We'll see. But yeah, see you guys soon. Just got to the engagement. This lighting's so shit. Damn, you look nice. That's all pink, all pink today. You don't want to be that? Yeah. Hey, fam. Looking good, Ashley. Thanks, guys. I know. Have you been wanting me? We were looking yes. They were waiting for you. He's at his birthday thing at his party. He was waiting for you. Because I had nothing else to wear. Hey, they were waiting for you. Were they? Yeah. I know. Because they're my best friend. Everyone loves Asha. Hi, Asha. Here. So this is a big thing for me, keeping this secret and stressing for the last couple of weeks. Yeah. But I'll do anything for these two. Okay. So I'm made a very good choice because you're very smart, you're a very good worker. Uh, good I think you're a very good match, you're very compatible with Ryan. Coming. Kelly, did thank you just want to? So do you want to thank everyone for coming? It's really, really nice, especially to have this person here tonight. Thanks for coming. They thank mean you so much to us. Yeah. And you, Bob, stop drinking stop. so much. We already said have water, Bob. Anyway, thank you guys. For yep. it's yeah. Yeah. It's been great. Um, should we tell everyone to come inside now? Yeah, yeah, guys, inside just now. come inside to cut the cake. Um, we're gonna cut the cake now. So if you can all come inside. Good morning guys. Sorry I didn't film so much yesterday. I had like a crazy, crazy busy day. Um, the engagement was good. I got a little bit drunk. So, but I'm not feeling too hungover today actually. I feel completely fine. I just quickly got ready because we're going to go get breakfast and go to the shops and do a few things. It's probably like the worst makeup I've done, like the wing. But I really couldn't be bothered redoing it because we're going out tonight. So I'm going to wipe all this off and do it all over again. But... Yeah, so we're going to go to the shops. I need to buy a few things. I think Yossip wants to get a top to wear tonight. Um, and I just need to get... I'm not too sure, actually. Like, need some more lash glue and little things like that. So we're going to go do that. I just wanted to show you what I got Yossip for his birthday. Because why not? I was going to show you guys when I was wrapping it. But just didn't have time. I was, like, running against time yesterday. So I'll show you what I got him now. And I also received a really, really cool parcel. So I'll show you what I got there as well. Our house is a bit of a mess right now because we just haven't been home. But I got him a new wallet. I got him actually his first wallet when we first dated, like his first birthday, but it was just a Tommy Hilfiger one, which is really nice, but he puts it in his toolbox and stuff. So I thought I'd get him one for going out. And he didn't want like Gucci or Louis Vuitton because he thinks everyone has them. So I got him this cool Fendi one. 
and my favorite part is that it's like red inside and it's like a card holder it's like perfect size as well it's not too big and i love that it's like thin but yeah i thought that was a really cool so i got that from sense which is where i got my jacquimus bag which i don't know if that's how you say it but yeah i got that bag from there as well and they come it comes so quick like so reliable i prefer sense over farfetch farfetch i think can be a little bit overpriced but i don't know that's just me but yeah and then mum gave me a hundred dollars to put towards his present so i just got him these from mum these calvin klein black board shorts because he doesn't own any black board shorts and then this is another gift I got him. Is this Tommy Hilfiger toiletry bag. It's actually huge. I didn't think how big it was, which that's great because he can put his like shampoos and pretty much perfume and like everything in there. So that's going to be really handy for when we go out. And then, yeah, also got him this gray Tommy top, which he actually has this in black and white as well. So, but it's just such an easy top. And I, he was saying that he wanted more gray tops. So I thought I'd get him that. I actually wanted to get a Lacoste one, but it they didn't have his size. So yeah, that's what he got. Very spoiled. So this is the other parcel that I got. It's from Taimana Boutique. I don't know if that's how you pronounce it, but look how cute. So I've got a necklace, a bracelet. That set is stunning. And then, but then how stunning are they? And then, yeah, this one's like my favorite literally love how that wraps i don't know if it's focusing there we go but yeah they, they sell super cute jewelry like i'm definitely there's so many things that i wanted off there but i just wanted to get a few rings first because that's sort of what i wear the most and then i literally don't even own a bracelet like i own a few so i don't own many bracelets and then yeah i only own a few necklaces as well so super excited to start my jewelry collection and wear actually start wearing jewelry so i'm gonna probably go buy a jewelry box because um i'm starting to own a bit more good quality jewelry so yeah i want to make sure i look after it all and yeah if you like anything guys that's a little discount code there for you yum so i got shitty soul feta avocado and two poached eggs and then i got a green juicy celery spinach apple and something else which tastes really healthy and then Yosef just got his big breakfast as always and a coffee yum we're starving it's literally now 12 o'clock having breakfast hey guys just a quick update we just got back from the shops I literally ended up spending $150 at Zara but what I got is so good um, also, where we had breakfast was so nice. It was called Il Cido, Il Cido, I don't know, I-L-C-I-D-O, and it's in Fremantle, and it was such a good breakfast. I still feel so sick and full from it because I think I overate. My stomach's so sore. But I'll show you guys what I got from Zara. It's honestly the best stuff I've bought for a long time, like very good quality material. So my friend actually has this bodysuit, which I copied her. So I got the brown bodysuit and this material is insane, like the comfiest material ever. Like it is so stretchy. Got that with the matching um, tights because I would so wear this out as a set with some like mules and like a cute little bag. I had to get it in black as well because I couldn't get over how good the material was. So I just got black tights and another black bodysuit because I feel like I would live in that. And I got this as well, which is the same material, which is the boob tube and i loved this color i feel like it's so nice size extra small to small in all of it it's so so stretchy i literally thought it wasn't going to fit because i'm a small not really extra small but it fit perfectly but yeah i got this um this top to wear with a pair of leather tights that i have from asos so i didn't really have a top to wear with them so i got that to wear with it because i just always wear black and white so i thought i'm trying to get like different colors so i'm not always wearing black and white but yeah that's what i got and yosip ended up getting like a nice jumper for him to wear tonight i probably won't wear this tonight because i'm so bloated from like food and my period i'm probably gonna wear like leather pants with a purple boob tube and like purple heels so i'm thinking that's what i'm gonna wear I'm going to take this makeup off because it's gone so patchy and gross. 
and like chill without makeup for a bit put a face mask on relax probably watch a movie and just chill for a bit we've been out all day and then i'm gonna get ready to go out so redo my whole face and do my hair i think i want to leave it down but i don't know if it's clean enough i mean i can maybe put some dry shampoo in it and see how i go but i'll show you guys what i end up wearing hopefully i find something and i'll check back in with you then just gonna chill for now so see you soon hey guys so i quickly got ready we've got guests here already so i'm running so late but i just did my hair just did my makeup these lashes are so extreme like wow i feel like they're so extreme i'm only used to doing like little lashes on the end for like a wing line liner look but because i'm going out i thought why not be a bit extreme but how cute's my new neon light it's my little new favorite thing ever and then that's just like my racks and stuff um that's all like stuff i need to get photos in I keep it on this rack, obviously all my colourful stuff as well. And that's just like, I try to keep that colour coordinated. But yeah, I just wanted to show you my new little neon light. And this is what I'm planning to wear. Um, that's from Fashion Nova. That's from Public Desire. And I wanted to wear it to match my little purple thing. I'm such a matchy matchy person. And my nails match. But yeah, this is what I'm planning to wear. So I'll show you guys once it's on. So that's the finished look. Sorry, it's loud out there. We've got guests, so I probably need to get out there. But it's so cute. These shoes are so cute. Lucky I got a size 10 in these pants because I'm so bloated right now. And they're about to pop off. But yeah, I'll probably see you guys tomorrow because the guests are here. And I'm going to have a drink because I need it after this busy ass day. And yeah, I'll see all of you tomorrow. Well, you'll see me. Hey guys. So I haven't updated you since Saturday night. This is actually the week after on a Sunday because after that Saturday night when I went out, the next day I woke up with the worst migraine. And yeah, I had to have Monday off work as well because the migraine was still so bad that day as well. I had another one that day. So I wasn't able to film Sunday, obviously, because I was just in bed with a migraine. So I had to cancel lunch and dinner for Yossip's birthday. But I rebooked it for this Sunday, which is now the following Sunday. So that's pretty much what we're going to do now is, yeah, go to lunch. Well, it's not really lunch. It's at five, um, our booking. So it's like a late lunch, early dinner. So I booked it at that time so we can, like, watch the sunset and have a cocktail and like hell chill vibes and obviously it's sunday so we have work tomorrow so i didn't want to book it too late but yeah i'll just show you what i'm wearing it's really cute it's really hot today so but i need to get a photo in this so i'm just gonna wear it hopefully it cools down once the sun goes down so this is the suit it's from mosman so i'm just wearing it with some bellini heels and my skims bodysuit that my friends got me for my birthday it's like a mesh bodysuit's really cute but i'll probably take the jacket off to be honest once i get this photo but yeah this suit is so flattering i love like how oversized the blazer is and how fitted the pants are i'm gonna bring my camera so you guys can see what we order um hopefully i'm not too embarrassed to bring it out but i should be fine we're such basic eaters by the way so don't expect anything too fancy we're really basic well i'm really basic but yeah i'll update you guys then disappointed so we went to coco's which is just on is this the river or ocean river. just on the river but yeah the reason i booked it is because i wanted something different like i sort of wanted like outdoors to look at the city just something different because we always go to crown or like Fremantle, and i just thought coco's cool location and i went there years years ago and i can't really remember if it was good then 
but it was pretty disappointing. It wasn't like the shittest food I've ever ate. Like it was, it was nice. The squid was nice, but I feel like everyone can make good squid. Yosip's pasta, he ordered like this pasta and they were like, oh, it's pretty chilly. Is that okay with you? And Yosip was like, yeah, that's fine. I tasted it and it was like not one bit chilly and I like can't handle chilli and it was like not one bit of chilli in there but it was like a nice sauce like it was a nice pasta but yeah that happened and then the cocktails were so bad like I got this lemon one and Yosef got this like pink one and it tasted like watery and then my one was just warm I sound like so negative whinging like I'm so grateful like sorry it just went dark because we're under all these trees but yeah, I sound so ungrateful, but like the food wasn't that bad, but I'm just being honest. Like it wasn't a really good experience. Like I probably will never book there or go there again. Maybe lunch is better or maybe we just ordered the wrong things. The Greek salad was really good, but I feel like anyone can make a good Greek salad. And what else we got? We got chips. The bruschetta was really nice. That's probably the best thing about the whole dinner was the bruschetta. We didn't even order like a steak, I guess, or like the fish. So I guess we could have ordered something better. I think what had me angry is the shit cocktails because I'm like, like I was looking so forward to a good cocktail and it was just like, Ugh. but who knows? Maybe we ordered the two shittest cocktails and there was probably better ones. So I should not be so negative because maybe some people really like it. But that was my experience. It wasn't the best and I just wanted to share it. Yeah, so negative, aren't I? All right, so I'm back home now. I was a bit moody in the car. I've got like the biggest headache from my hair, which I'm gonna take down. But yeah, my skin is so bad, guys. Like, look at these bumps. You probably noticed it when I was talking in the car. But look at how bad it is. I honestly think it's from stress and like hormonal pimples because it's literally just here and look at my makeup like it's all come off like how the hell have i done that i need to sort that out this app because i'm really insecure about it i just wanted to say like i was so negative in the car just because i had the biggest headache and it wasn't like you know when it doesn't match your like it doesn't is it reach your expectations like it doesn't reach your expectations like i had higher expectations and I was just a little bit disappointed. But that's fine. It wasn't like really shit. Like our night was still good. We ended up getting waffles to be honest after because we weren't satisfied. Which I'll put in here. So yeah, the waffles were really nice and now I feel really satisfied. That's why I've undone my pants because they were literally about to pop. I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog. Sorry that it was really like, I feel like it was really rushed. But I promise you, it like, I'll get better at it. I just had a really hectic last weekend and this weekend. But I really wanted to finish it off today as opposed to last week because I don't think I had that much footage, to be honest. And I really wanted to bring you guys with me today. So that's why I'm finishing it today. I hope you liked this video. If you did, please give it a thumbs up or if you like vlogs, give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe so you don't miss any more of my videos. I notice you guys prefer my vlogs as opposed to my other videos so I will keep trying to get some vlogs out for you. I love filming vlogs. I just need to remember to bring my camera and film. Thanks so much for watching guys and I'll see you all in my next video.